Several major Canadian grocery store chains pulling romaine lettuce from their shelves today nationwide after a warning from the Public Health Agency of Canada not to eat the leafy greens linked to an outbreak of E. coli infections. Why hasn't the government of Canada issued a mandatory recall of romaine? Well, that question went to the Minister of Health today. Here's her response. Well, we, um, as you all know, uh, protecting the health and safety of Canadians is our top priority. The situation is being investigated, uh, and we are certainly encouraging all Canadians to ensure that they don't uh, consume uh, any romaine lettuce. But the advice from the minister not exactly lining up with the message coming from the Public Health Agency of Canada, which is advising individuals in Ontario and Quebec to avoid eating romaine lettuce and salad mixes containing romaine lettuce until more is known about the outbreak and the cause of contamination. Currently, there's no evidence to suggest that residents in other parts of Canada are affected by this outbreak. But now, today, residents in New Brunswick are being advised to avoid romaine after a confirmed E. coli case there. That's on top of the 18 E. coli cases reported in Ontario and Quebec since October. In the U.S., more than 30 cases have been reported. The recall issue raised in question period today. Cases of E. coli have been occurring for over a month in Canada by people who consume romaine lettuce. Just now, the Center for Disease Control and Prevention in the United States has ordered grocery stores to pull this contaminated product. It took over a month for the Liberals just to inform Canadians that the lettuce they're eating might not be safe. Why haven't the Liberals issued a recall to protest or to protect the Canadians? Right, Honourable Prime Minister. Mr. Speaker, protecting the health and safety of Canadians is our government's top priority. We are collaborating with provincial health authorities as well as the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and the FDA in the United States to investigate the outbreak of E. coli infections linked to romaine lettuce. While so far not directed to do so by the government, chains like Sobeys, Metro and Loblaws have stopped selling romaine across Canada. Loblaws says the move is out of an abundance of caution. A common source of E. coli is raw fruits and vegetables that have come in contact with feces from infected animals. And there's no real treatment for it. Symptoms can appear within 1 to 10 days after contact with the bacteria. They include nausea, vomiting, headache and mild fever. As officials continue to investigate another heads up from the Public Health Agency of Canada, saying romaine lettuce it can have a shelf life of up to five weeks. So it's possible that contaminated romaine lettuce purchased over the past few weeks may still be in your home.